Okay, this is Rani Ahmad. Uh, I'm gonna be your teacher, teacher for this series of uh, TKTCL, uh, programming language uh, and scripting language too. Um, uh, this lesson uh, we're gonna teach you how to install TKTCL uh, on Linux and Windows, uh, and also it works on Macintosh. But I'm gonna just talk about Linux and uh, Windows alone because this is what I know. Um, the on Mac is very, it's gonna be very easy. Uh, now I'm running uh, Linux here, and uh, I'm running also Windows XP on uh, virtual machine uh, using VirtualBox, and uh, uh, let's start installing. Uh, so uh, all you have to do is. You go to Synaptic okay, here in Debian. Uh, if you are using something like a Red Hat based uh, system, okay, uh, use YUM or whatever uh, given. We need uh, those packages for our uh, throughout uh, the whole course. Okay. So for the whole subject here, so I'm going to put my administrator password here. And okay, uh, my packages are already installed. There's nothing much to do other than selecting them and installing them. So <coughs> we need TCL. Okay, so uh, we need the latest one here, 8.5. Uh, if you use this one, it will install for you the 8.4 as it's mentioned here, but we need uh, 8.5 and install also MySQL TCL because later we're going to talk about connecting MySQL uh, database to TCL with uh, connecting to, to, to MySQL database uh, through uh, TCL that's late in like a 20th uh, something uh, lesson and also uh, we have to install TK okay which is TK point 8.5. Now I'm gonna explain what's TK and what's the TCL. TCL is uh, the part of the language that's that's uh, that's just normal language. Okay, there's nothing much, just basic command line output. And TK is the toolkit. Okay, which the uh, which is uh, supports to do for us uh, GUI applications okay graphical user interface applications like using a mouse and buttons and uh, you know all those labels that we see usually on our uh, graphical interface and what else yes and uh, TCL okay is short for a uh, tool command language which is uh, which uses uh, the form of commands and uh, command line uh, methodology of writing uh, the program okay uh, so it's gonna uh, be translated as a normal program later now just for n for now okay uh, gonna just talk about installation so in the next lesson gonna start talking about how to write NTCL and you see it's, it's much different than C++ or Java okay everything has to be commands okay um, so after selecting this and that okay it will automatically select all the rest uh, of the required packages and you just uh, press apply like if I'm gonna select the 8.4 version press apply okay and it will download them it will tell you how much it's gonna take you okay to download it now and um, let me see if we need this wish. Now, so this is all that you need. Okay, wish is part of TK. Let's just uh, skeptic a little here, and that's it. And just let go. Okay. Now on Windows. We have to go to this website. Let me first 
type name on a bigger sheet view format font like 20 and go to this link because those are the supporters of TCL okay maybe more bigger just to make it clearer oh <laughs> that's too much okay maybe like this okay so this is it they're called active, st uh, active state uh, those people are responsible for uh, TCL and supporting TCL now you select the latest version download the Windows EXE installer okay take the one that's like uh, x86 okay uh, the, that's 32 bit version if you can and uh, uh, if you want the 64 bit version never mind okay you can install this one just download it once you download it and complete the download uh, you will have uh, this package is around like uh, 26 megabytes okay see and double click and just run it next you accept the license next and hit uh, now I have already a folder just press next and continue the installation as usual okay yes I want to cancel it okay there's nothing much to do um, now also we'll have to go online and Google for uh, MySQL package uh, for uh, okay uh, MySQL TCL uh, Windows platform binary now I select this okay and save it wherever I want then I have it already here okay I open zip file it's a zip file so you must have one zip or any zip uh, application that can open this uh, zip file double click here you right click and copy all that and go to where TCL is installed which is installed on my drive here on TCL and go to lib and right click and paste them so to tell you yes you wanna place them because they are already there okay so I'm telling you just leave them there okay this is where you should uh, copy them and later you can just easily uh, run uh, MySQL uh, connect to MySQL database server okay so later we can t tell you how uh, to make a tiny program using MySQL now of course not yet but once the sales is around 20th uh, uh, lesson okay and uh, that's it okay uh, I'm gonna stop this lesson and start later with the next one with the first lesson on writing code